if you need to have a special day and let you see the things that we do during the day and uh, hopefully teach you some uh, a little bit about fire safety and John David needed to help me uh Well, that's how I met it. We do several different things. Uh, sometimes we're trained. Uh, when, we're, when we have our downtime, we have the day room that we go to. Sometimes we watch training videos. Uh, when we have a chance, we can sit and read or we can watch television, watch movies, play games. Uh, would you like to see it? Come on in. And this is our day room. We have our recliners and our couch and our television. Um, this is where we hang out after after hours on our downtown. Where we we eat in the kitchen. This is our kitchen. This is another place we like to hang out too. Uh, we have everything that we can cook. Uh, we have food in our cabinets. Uh, we like to cook a lot of meals. Um, sit around and uh, talk to each other around the table. We have TV in here and uh, play cards and. Uh, just enjoy each other's company. We work uh, 24 hours. We're here for 24 hours and then uh, we're off in four years. We say we have phone press. We say we have not a lot of money at all. If we come here, I'll show you our phone press. Thank you. One of our phone rooms. We all share rooms and uh, we have several beds and everybody, everybody has their own individual bed. And uh, as you can see, we've got a TV in here so we can, we can watch a little TV after, after time. And if we have a call in the middle of the night, the lights come on and the buzzer goes off, and we all go to the bed and run and get on the engines and go. Well, we've got a ladder truck. And we've got two engines that run out down here. We've got a reserve engine and a truck line engine. And we've got another engine at the other station that, that also works. Sure. This is the ladder truck. Um, we use it uh, to do the ladder risk. It has a knob on it where we can spray water. Um, it has a pump and it also has other lines. We carry a lot of air packs and rescue tools on here. And uh, we can use it in just about any of the equipment that you or a lot of the this is engine 11. This is uh, one of the engines that we have that responds. Uh, we respond to medical calls in it. Uh, we go when people are, are sick and need help. Uh, we've got all of our medical equipment on there. Uh, we also uh, go to fires and fight fires with it. It has a pump and a, and a tank and, and hoses just like the ladder truck. Uh, we also have our air packs and um, we keep our gear on there and they can, so we can use it uh, to fight fire. We also keep our jaws of life on there. So if people are in, in car wrecks, we can uh, take the jaws of life and, and cut them off and, and uh, get to them that way. But that's what we use Engine 11 for. Some of my friends think fire fighters scared. Well, I can understand why they think that. We, when uh, we go into a fire, we have to wear about some gear to help protect us from the heat and smoke. And sometimes what we look like and the way we sound can probably be scary to some kids. My friend Jimmy over here, is dressed up uh, in, in all of our gear, uh, and we have our fire suit that we wear with our gloves. We have our helmet and our air tank mask, and in the dark and, and in smoke, it could be a little scary and it could be sound, but you don't need to be afraid because we're here to help. Even though we look a little frightened, um, this, this helps protect us and helps us get in safe so we can inside that situation. And I'm going to have Jimmy take his, uh, his gear off and, and show you that he's just a firefighter and then he's all this gear. Jimmy, come on. Come on, Jimmy. Jimmy,
Underneath all this fear is just another person like you and me. And now John David is going to demonstrate what to do in case you close this on fire. John David, would you show us what to do? Show him stop, drop, and roll. You want to cover your face with your hands and roll around and put the fire out. Uh, this is our pickup. We uh, use it to uh, run errands, uh, pick up equipment, pick up our food. Um, anytime we have a big fire, we need to uh, bring, move men around or, or uh, uh, fill air paint bottles. We load them up in the back of the truck, bring them back down here to the station and fill them up. And it's just a general all around uh, running around vehicle. Thank you, Dennis. Any other questions? You're quite welcome, John David. I'm really glad you came by and got to visit with us today, and uh, hopefully you learned something. Yeah. <laughs>